Good morning, Canes. Welcome to the Hurricane News. Today is a day two schedule. Please rise for the pledge. I pledge, I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Bishop McLaughlin's homecoming week is next week. Get your gear ready for special themes day next week. The football team will return to Bishop October 14th after two games on the road. Here is the lineup for homecoming themes days. Monday is America Day. Tuesday is TV Tuesday. Wednesday is Mathletes versus Athletes. Thursday is Hawaiian Day. And Friday is Ultimate Spirit Day. Bishop celebrated the feast day of St. Francis Tuesday with the blessing of the animals. Many Bishop families came with dogs, cats, and other pets for the blessing in the front of the school organized by Campus Ministry and the Theology Department. Now, here's Danny with sports. Thanks, Devin. The Bishop volleyball team fought very hard on Tuesday, but lost to Springstead High School in its final home match this season. The team will be on the road today at 5 against the Tampa Heat. The Bishop golf team beat Nature Coast, Wigiwashi, and Lakanto in a quad match Tuesday. The team has a home match today at 4 o'clock at Beacon Woods against Academy at the Lakes and will play in a district tournament in the beginning of Monday. Our football team is on the road again and plays Zephyr Hills. Christian tomorrow. It returns home next Friday for its homecoming game against Out of Door Academy. Senior Night for Swimming has been rescheduled for Tuesday. Senior festivities will begin at 6 o'clock p.m. and the swim meet will begin afterward at 6.30. Bishop asks that you come out to support all of our athletes. Back to you, Kaylee. Thanks, Danny. Cam, how will the weather be going into this weekend? Thanks, Kaylee. We're keeping our eye on Hurricane Matthew and have been getting rain because of it. It is trending north. Some initial paths had the storm coming through the middle of Florida after hitting the Keys, but current projections have Matthew heading north, but staying off the Atlantic coast, touching northern Florida and Georgia directly on Friday. Our extended forecast shows cloudy and rainy days, with highs in the mid-80s. Lows will be in the low 70s. We need to keep checking on Hurricane Matthew's path. Back to you, Devin. Thanks, Cam. Students, don't forget to order your Bishop yearbook or buy a memory page. Go to jostens.com to pre-order and personalize your book. See Ms. David, the yearbook advisor, for more information. That's Hurricane News for today, Thursday, October 6th. Please silence yourselves for prayer. In the name of the Father, Son, and the Holy Spirit. God, grant us your mercy, grace, and peace. And let peace begin with me. Amen. St. Charles Bermeo, pray, pray for, for us. us. In the name of the Father, Son, and the Holy Spirit. For Kaylee, Cam, Bobby, Mr. Z, and myself, have a great day, Canes.